What's up? Melissa Tierney, Santa Barbara Realtor, Keller Williams Realty coming at you live in downtown Santa Barbara from the Keller Williams office. I'm here today to talk about some, just some, of the Halloween events that are going on here in Santa Barbara. Halloween is this weekend. It's actually Monday, but this is the last weekend we have until Halloween. So I'm going to run down my pick for the top five events that I'll be considering and I hope a lot of other people are also considering. I have included this information below in the description for you guys to take a look at for yourselves and make your own decisions. But the first event I'm going to talk about is Boo at the Zoo. This is a super fun, super safe event because there are there's no traffic you gotta worry about. It is at the zoo. So if you're in the mood to get into the Halloween spirit, go trick-or-treating and find some monstrous thrills at the zoo, check out the link below. You need an online reservation. There are separate tickets for it. And I think one of the days is already sold out this weekend. So take a look and decide what's best for you. The second event that is worth considering certainly is the Monster Mash at Paseo Nuevo Mall in downtown Santa Barbara. That is going to be on the 29th from, well, I can't remember off the top of my head, it's in the afternoon, I think three o'clock until seven o'clock? Check the link below. Anyway, uh, Go and have some trick-or-treating fun. The first 300 kids that show up that are between the age of four and 11 will get a little trick-or-treating backpack. There are gonna be some surprises for the best dress costumes. There's gonna be a live DJ, it's free admission. Check out the link below. On that note, um, there I did a video on the pumpkin patches in Santa Barbara that are also worth, worth checking out and even outside Santa Barbara if you're wanting to take a little road trip. So definitely check that video out as well. So the third event worth checking out this weekend is going to be the a thrilling event. It is the Thriller 2022, which is going to be the World Dance for Humanity. They are celebrating the 40th anniversary of the original Thriller album release in 1982, which is still supposedly the biggest selling album of all time. People with all at all ages and abilities are welcome to come learn the Thriller dance as well as other Halloween dances at the Sunken Gardens in downtown Santa Barbara. Click the link below for the information on where, when, the Zoom link, and the suggested donation. The fourth event is going to be a 21 and over event at the Santa Barbara Museum of Natural History. This is going to be the Creep the Halls party. There's going to be food, drinks, performers, live band, dancing, and even a spooktacular finale under the big top. So check the link below in the description for the information on when, how much, and all of those magical details. Last but not least, Come on down to the South Coast Railroad Museum and Train Depot for a haunted or spooky train and haunted depot. That's what it is. Bring the whole family. There's going to be trick or treating around the depot, rides on the spooky train, tasty popcorn crafts, games and more. Free admission, costumes encouraged, certainly not required, will be from 4 to 7 p.m. Link is below. So there you have it. Just some of the events and happenings going on on this last weekend prior to Halloween of 2022, which will be on Monday. So grab your costumes and your spooktacular gear and gear up for a thrilling Halloween 2022. Definitely let me know you if you enjoyed this video. Leave me a comment, give me a like, and check out the other video I, I did on the pumpkin patches as well to make sure you have the best Halloween this year.